I believe the NFL Network will stop showing the Super Bowl highlights from you know the, the 60s, the 70s, the 80s, and the 90s. Th- those highlight films will suddenly yeah. disappear. So many examples, but I remember one in particular, the, the first Steelers Super Bowl, with, where my good friend Franco Harris was the MVP, where they played the Vikings, and there was a, a pass by, by the Vikings down to about the six-yard line, and uh, Mel Blunt almost takes the receiver's head off, uh, almost takes his head off. There's a... NFL Films puts a boing sound effect in, in yeah. the 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 play, <laughs> like it's it, like it's comical. The the ball pops up into the air, and the Steelers make a key interception. I mean, it's a game. The guy, that game was only sixteen six, even though the Steelers dominated the Vikings. Had that play happened today, Blunt gets kicked out of the game. Vikings have the ball first and goal. And it could be a completely different game, but people are going to look back on those things and go, what the hell was this? Like, you know, this like video of the gladiators in the Coliseum or something, uh, because this is a completely different uh, sport than what we currently have and what we will have in the future. All over the place where the fun sanity never ends. The opinions expressed by the guests are theirs and do not necessarily reflect those of the hosts or the producer.